I'm Adam Trout. Someone said to me, bitch, you owe me a podcast. And I said, okay. And then this podcast came to me and it just so happened to be the CSBS. Joining me now, Coach Duracell. Say some words, boys. Uh, well, last night, kind of bad nightmare. Oh, for real? Wow, you just yeah. had a... I had, oh, well, I you mean, it wasn't me. Go right into a story. Like, yeah, you guys want to know what it was about? Yeah, sure. go ahead. About fucking Karen. What? Mm, you really? had a nightmare about Karen? She burnt my pizza. That's awfully funny. Fucking bitch. Why would she burn your pizza in your nightmare? Because I was hungry. All right, well... So, oh, that makes sense. Yeah. In your yeah. pizza, so she's, al- she's always keeping food from us, I feel like. I think she hides it. I, she's, I don't think she eats it all. She hides it under all the like layers of fat in her body. That's toxic. Well... Well, I mean, I did see some M&M's fall out of her one time. Just fell out of her. I don't know where they fell. They just a whole loaf f- of bread. A whole loaf? On the floor. Just down? Just Did you eat it? No. Oh. It came from her skirt. I was like, no. I mean, is she a shoplifter? Uh, no, she's not. But what's funny is she was sleeping last night, and I was just up, you know, late night. I couldn't fall asleep because it was a thunderstorm. Right. And all of a sudden, I hear... Moobs. Mm, what? Um, just... just <laughs> Moobs. Moobs. I'm like, moobs? moobs? So I look up moobs and all I, I asked, I, porn came up and I was just like, great, great. So apparently moobs. You no, know moobs are right. You didn't know, man man boobs. Boobs. No. You didn't know that before you didn't know your that? wife nope. mub- mumbled that word in her sleep. Well, that's what nope. she likes about you. Let's just review. Daracel was I, sleeping and dreaming about Karen who was sleeping and dreaming about man boobs. Moobs. Boobs. 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 It's a funny word to say. Yeah. I feel like we got to get Karen on the line. Yeah, here. Let me give me your number. Uh, I think I have her number. She, she sent me those text messages. Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's yeah see yeah, if yeah, she'll yeah. even answer. She may not. She hates me a lot. Why? Ran over I mean, our kids' bicycle. Did we listen to the podcast? Hopefully not. She may, <laughs> she may not answer. I'm telling you. If she doesn't answer, that's two times in a row we tried to call her. She doesn't answer. Knock, knock. Who's there? Karen. Karen who? Not Karen. What the fuck? Does she know that we do the podcast? And so she's hey, like, this is Karen with Pet Lube and Lotion. I can't come to the phone right now because I'm writing a new book on lubrication. It's non-friction. Anyway, I'll call you back. <laughs> At the tone, please record your message. Wow. When you I'm leaving her a message. You may hang up all or right. press Can we all leave her a message? more options. Karen. You, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Burn I'm my just, pizza, my nightmare. Just, Goddamn I'm so bitch. sorry you have to no. deal with this. Karen, Darisel had a dream you burned his pizza. That's unacceptable. Also, Coach is saying you said moobs in your sleep. I, yes. don't, I don't understand. And also, I knew about Oops. the lube business that you were running, but I didn't know you were writing a book. Uh, that does seem hard. I thought we said we wouldn't talk about that. Well, well I wasn't well, going to, but now we put it out in the yeah, it's a <sighs> lubrication book. I mean, she's an expert. All right. Yeah. Let's call us back or don't call us back. Whatever. We know where you live. Give me some lube. I don't even know. Don't, why don't you have to whisper? I don't know if we should. Why don't you have to whisper? I you should. Give me some lube. You should whisper. If you're going to say, give me some lube, you should be whispering. See, if you say, why? hey, give me some lube. Give me some and lube. Now, now I'm like looking that. for some lube. Hey. A little. Hey. May you help hey. me find the lube? Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey. Give me some lube. Yeah. <laughs> so weird. Hold on. May you help me find the lube. <laughs> May you help me find the well, lube. Well, I mean, like, if you can't, you're in a store, you can't find the lube. It's like you're translating English to English. <laughs> it's like a bad oh. translation of English. Uh, well, now that Kaler, K- Kalen, now that Karen has derailed the fucking show, I've got a couple of uh, agenda items to review. Uh, here's what's on top: man hits a huge head. Mm-hmm. Dogs, fucking dogs. Okay, and right. not that sounds weird if I say it like that. It's not uh, dogs having sex with dogs. It's, just, it's dogs. just dogs, fucking dogs. Okay. Yeah, and then we have warning labels. Why? I don't know why. Because why? warning labels are essential. No, I'm uh, not. Ultimate bed, the ultimate bed. Uh-huh. Okay, uh, and something called explain it to me. Explain what to you? Ah, see, you're already interested. You, your interests have been peaked. Peaked interests. Peaked. I can't even. Speak. The peak of the interests. Yeah, you got the peaks and the interests of time. Times of the interests. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Interest. Interesting times. That's not right now. <laughs> It's true. That's true, man. It's not right now. It's no. not. All right. So when I said man hits a huge head, do you yeah, guys do know? You mean by that? Do you guys know those um, huge heads on on Easter Island? Nope. You, ha- I have one in the backyard or in the back. Never been. Not. 
Yeah, you guys. I've never been in your backyard. It's true. We never go back there. We just kind of come up into the studio. And never been to Easterhead either. Well, no one. I don't. I didn't know you could go there. I thought it was. I mean, What's I didn't Easterhood. Think you, not Easterhood. There's Yo, a- Easterhood. <laughs> Where my bunny rabbit at, bitch? <laughs> bitch better have my eggs. I got a twix up my tweet. Uh No, there's a uh, <laughs> an island. What's the name of the island? Uh, Rapa, nu- Rapa Nui's. Rapa Nui's. Yeah. Isn't that the name of um, Dr. Hey. Dr. Fate's helmet? That's Naboo or something. Why do I know that? Why that's, are we having this Naboo. conversation <laughs> right that's now? That's Naboo. Why do we all three know that? Naboo. Oh, damn, that's dorky. It's a very niche thing to know, but we are a dork. We all know it. No. I knew the answer. If that's built dorky, like then fork. he's the wicked witch of the east. <laughs> Did you just tell me I was built like a fork? Indeed, good. Built sir. like a fork, you built like a bowl of salad. <laughs> In my Easter hood, and you're gonna toss it? No. <laughs> anyway, somebody I'm open. Somebody was times. backing up a pickup truck, uh-huh. right, on the island. Yes. And they hit one of these huge heads. Wait, 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 wait. It's an island, and yeah. they're backing up a truck right. on an island. I have all the same questions. That's exactly right. So Easter Island, I'm is afraid a, of boats, is an island, and on the island there are these heads. They're huge. I don't know how big they are, but they're probably bigger than the room we're in. Okay. But, but it turns out when they when you dig them up, there are like bodies down beneath them, but they're just called the heads of Easter Island. And they're on an island called Rapa Nui. Rapa so there's Nui. statues that got buried underneath the sand. Yeah, like you don't really know how that came to be, but that's how it pretty they much probably happened. were statues. And then you, you know, you did just kind of wrap up something that I've wondered about my whole life in like one sentence. So appreciate. I know. I mean, I'm. I thank you. I never thought about it so simply. <sighs> <laughs> just pass gas while you're looking at me. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Nice. He did. Uh, anyone? Anyone? Anyway, on March first, uh, the indigenous community that is tasked there on the national. Rapa Nui Park. Indigenous? Yeah, they live there. Okay. Um, a four-door truck rolled off the edge of a grassy area. It appeared to be stuck on volcanic volcanic rocks, but in fact, it had hit one of the heads and knocked it over. It had been there for thousands oh. of years, and some dumbass's brakes went out on his truck when it was parked, and he ran into one of these heads. Wow. Uh, I just want to know how the truck got there. I'm more interested in the truck yeah, getting it d- there. Yeah, you know, I read the whole story because I wanted that information, too. It just says it, it appeared to have rolled down a hill due to a brake failure. Uh, it's an incalculable amount of damage because, I mean, you can't repair or replace this, you know. Well, yeah, because then it's not, you know, it's not a, whatchamacallit. There's one. Replaceable? S- yeah. <laughs> you okay there? Sorry, big brain farts. <laughs> it's the COVID, man. It's got us twitchy. Sleepy. Uh, anyway, there's, there's a thousand of these statues there. A thousand? Uh, yeah. And I these, thought it was only like seven. No, there's a whole bunch. They're all over there. See, that's the thing. That's one of those things like they teach you when you're young. Even like I've in the 70s and 60s. Age. Yeah, stuff like that. Movies and whatever. And uh, it looks like there's only like six or seven of these things, but there's thousands of them. And there's hundreds of these platforms that hold them up, kind of. Still more interested in the truck getting there. Uh, here's a picture of the of the island. Some of the heads. There's thousands of those all around. Oh, I've, I've I heard it's about nice that story. Sky. This guy is nice, right? And the water looks good. I want to go there. Anyway, what's this like that? Dip your toes in the just water. Just put my toes. Just the tip. Just the tip. Tackle shaft. <laughs> One of these things, guys, weighs 14 tons. Hand. And that's how big and heavy this thing grilled. is. Grilled. Suicide. Hand grilled suicide. Oh, uh, man. Now I'm thinking about hand grilled suicide. Why? Because of three skin. Oh, this thing's off the western coast of Chile. That's what I was looking for. Where Four was skin? Three skin? Two skin? One skin? No, just five there's skin. No, there's oh. no one skin. One skin's well, just... Well, now there is a one skin, okay? No, one, Get off my back. One skin. Hop off. Is just skin. Hop off my cock. No, 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 call. no. If you just have just, one skin, you just, just say skin. skin. Nope. One ridiculous. skin. No, it's ridiculous. Anyway, this place gets 150,000 tourists a year. Not funny. Did it last. Oh, come on. We're talking about foreskin and and You guys are talking about foreskin. I'm having a very serious conversation about Rapa Nui. Well, our dick conversation is more interesting than that. You've said dick more times than me. I mean, in this case, a man hit his large head with a pickup truck. And in your head, you're talking, your (laughs) your situation is about one skin. I don't know. That's That's what they said. I want to know how the truck got there. I just was, I mean, it doesn't say I read the whole story twice. It doesn't say. It is a mystery, though. I agree with you. I do agree with you. Oh, I forgot to say, I tell you guys, I arranged a uh, special guest caller for our question of the week. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. My What's brother. His name? You guys know my brother. Do I have no, to say it? Never met his brother in my life. I Long forgot. Fellow I, I really thought you were the only child. No. It's, I think it's, I met him one time when I was it's really Adam, drunk. It's Adam Eagle Trout, and his name is Longfellow Hawk Trout. My parents were hippies. No, your parents were Native American. <laughs> 
just call him Hawk. <laughs> Why do you ask? Two dogs fucking. And just call him Hawk. Uh, Hawk yeah, you can call cock. him Hawk. He probably like that. All right, Hawk the cock. Hawk. Don't call him Hawk the cock. No. <laughs> <laughs> what is what is happening with the music situation? What is that coming from? I'm once again asking for your financial. Oh, I wonder how that happened. You weren't so even, weird. Uh, anyway. You weren't even touching that. Yeah, yeah it's it's so yeah. weird. Like I explained that like last episode or a few episodes ago. What's going on? I don't know. Restart it. Weird, right? Double tap that thing. Restart. It. I don't know why our our. Uh, yeah, he might. He might have to Just unplug, unplug the thing. Yeah, he might be right. Unplug it. Remember when that was happening to us yeah. to like Podcast 5? Yeah. So weird. Way back in Podcast 5. And y'all just wouldn't believe me? No, we so believed weird. <laughs> we believed you. Huh. I just didn't know how to fix it. Yeah, it's crazy, right? Yeah. Nope. Sound Soundboards are weird. It's weird that that one defaulted to Bernie Sanders talking. No, it's because someone accidentally clicked it. Who's someone? There's no someone. You're the only person by no. it. Coach over here went over here and tried to go, oh, yeah. and, like slide down the thing. I think what you did, Coach, was act of heroism. I'm gonna sneeze into the mic. Don't. That's my mic. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> that doesn't punish him in any way. Do it. Oh my god. All right. Any other news? That's the uh, that's the man. It's a huge head. Now this other one I really want. Dogs. Fucking dogs. Have you guys heard yeah, about explain. this thing? It's called the cuss collar. What is that? You put this on your dog, and when they bark, it cusses. What? Uh, yeah. So you can have uh, all kinds of like really hardcore gangster rap conversations with your dog. So you can create a rap song with your dog. Yeah, I'm sure. Beginning to feel like a rap dog. Rap dog. Yeah. I'm trying to find Boys. out what cuss words are in. Oh, it does, here we go. You ready? Bullshit, fuck, shit, asshole, and many, and many others. So the dog will go, bark, 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 and you hear bullshit, fuck, asshole. I think that's amazing, and I want one. Wait, is it like coordinated, or is it just random? Uh, it says it fastens around your dog's neck and will spit, spit out a swear word every time your dog barks. The collar is pre-recorded like, with all your favorite words. That's what like you do. Like if a bark like, is longer, will it be like the f word? Yeah, or no, if no, a bark is shorter, it will be like ass or something. Every time you use the, or if it's like long, uh, is it just like fuck? Yeah, exactly like that. It doesn't say. I really want to buy one. I want to know how much they are. I don't My see a place. <laughs> is you You've used that one so many hey. times. It's not, every time you touch it, you break it. Yeah. Upside touch down. Me. If you touch it right side up, it's okay. Um, yeah, I don't know how to buy this thing. I've looked online. It says it's a thing. There's no link in here to buy it it's anywhere. Probably like $60. Uh, it's free real estate. Would you, how much would you pay? 60, 60 bucks? No, uh, I'd, I'd pay like pay, 30. Yeah, I'd pay like 40 bucks tops. Well, 40? I think I pay 100 bucks for this. That's 12. Oh my God, I found it. Oh, you did? Yeah. It's childish. Oh, it's a video. It's a video. Yeah. The video. Oh, here he comes. Oh, oh, okay. there he goes. Yeah. All right. Hi, Grandpa. Hey. So this is Grandpa. G R A N D P A W. Why are they Grandpa's not this? a good dog. Don't spell that. He's a great dog. Yes. That's yeah. what he always says. Oh my god. And he, this know, dog he, deserves to he cuss. He likes dogs. He I would curse people. too. This is the advertisement for the thing the dog hasn't barked one time. This is horrible. Just fucking bark. So we all. Yeah, if Grandpa could talk, he'd probably say, How long is this? I love you. 30 seconds left. He'd probably say something like that. Yeah. Here we go. So we actually have this uh, new dog collar. Well, you know what your dog is really saying. Um, Can we put it on? Oh, Um, my God. Oh, that's fucked. The the, the collar's on. Collar's on. (laughs) Oh, shit. Are you sure? (laughs) What? No, my dog would not cuss. I don't want to hear fuck. Uh, that's how they did it, huh? Oh, my God. All right. Well, uh, sounds like a waste of money. I, wa- I yeah. want yeah, I want to good be... quality. Unless you, yeah. like, invite your grandparents over and you're like, hey, I put, I found this collar that, like, says what my dog's thinking no, all the time. I, I still want it. I want, yeah, I want it to be louder. It says it, it says it plays it. That doesn't. Oh, it activates up to 80 decibels. No, I want it to play louder. Uh, it says 60 bucks. Who said 60? Do you have 60? Who had 60? 60 in the back. 61, 62, no, 60, 63, 30. 64, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 40, 40, 40 in the back. Yeah, it was 60 bucks. Plus free shipping on that shit. Free shipping. I mean, I yeah, I'm not impressed anymore. I want not impressed to, by what? I want it to be more aggressive. Like, fuck, shit. Like, I don't want it to be just fuck. It's so like a black fuck. man named Marquise. Shit. Why is your black man Asshole. named Asshole. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you are retarded. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like that. Yeah. I wanted to give insults too. I do. I want my bark collar to what be What are you saying? To people. 
I don't care. Have you ever been walking down the street and just want to punch someone in the face? Yeah. Well, th- why would it say that? That would invoke violence. Because you're a faggot. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think the dog car should say that. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> good hey, Christ. That's pretty good. <laughs> you guys suck. Uh, all right. Now, there's something called a montroversy, a mom traversy going on. Like a, a mom, mom like traversy. Mom? Oh, like mom, mother's mom, controversy. A mom controversy. So there's this whole thing where some lady has invented a tag for your baby. Uh, what? Like, like a like a like a name tag. Look, here's a picture. Oh, of okay. it's big though. It's like as big as their head. Why? What, why? why? What's right? point? For what reason? They want people to know about the baby before they approach the baby. So like, it says, "I know I am Fucking the cutest." This one, for, for example, <laughs> dude, for real, <laughs> I have to ask my kid uh, for consent to change his diaper. <laughs> May I please change your diaper? What? How do you know he says no? Well, I mean, he giggles. So right. I, I does think that mean that's yes? A yes? I don't think you can apply that till your whole life. By the way. Yeah, I mean, I don't think you should either. I mean, they giggled, so you know, I changed their <laughs> Next diaper. Next thing you know, two women accuse me of rape. No. <laughs> two, <laughs> two. Maybe we should get out of here. <laughs> they giggled. All right, <laughs> uh, you're the one. Here's an example of what this tag says. It <laughs> says, "I know I'm the cutest baby ever, but I'm still growing my immunity, so don't touch me." You know, what my favorite is yes. I forgot what we were talking about <laughs> completely. So. I want to go like, back to 2010. It's like I saw your eyes roll back in your head and you just like forgot. We're, none of us are sleeping, by the way. Did you sleep? You sleep. You slept last night. You said you slept because you had that dream, but I don't think I slept yeah, at all. Then, I night. slept. Dude, what is sleep? Dude. I mean, I wake up, it's like noon and I'm drunk. I don't know where I'm at. I'm not I'm drunk. No, that's your problem. You don't drink enough. I don't drink at all. Uh, anyway, this one says, stop. You are too close. Please don't touch me. So it's like these moms label these babies. Right, yeah, and no, it's, God, please, no, and it's, no, it's that saying, no. Messages. So what? I'm thinking no. I would buy this and use this completely inappropriately. Yeah, like my <laughs> my message might say, "Want some candy?" Uh, it's and it might be like a question mark to you, but also has a command, <laughs> like "I want some candy." <laughs> so you'd use your kid I actually, for? I actually saw this video the other get day. Get candy? And yeah, we, sure. Or, that's what I mean. Say, hey, you I might watched get this, some money. I watched this video the other day, and this guy goes. Hey, Candy, want some kids? And oh, yeah, kids yeah, yeah. Like, We shouldn't talk to strangers. Yeah, I saw that one. Yeah, it was really hilarious. Yeah. Yep. Thanks for wasting that 10 seconds. I just I just thought it was really funny. No, it is. It's not bad. So I not have bad. a question not before bad. we start this next thing. All, All right. right. What's All the right. next so thing? Me and Coach. Are we done with this label? Hey. I guess we're done with the baby thing. Me and Coach <laughs> were sitting on the couch one time. Okay. And he was like, you know Miami's an island? What? Miami. <laughs> He says, "Did you know Miami is yeah. an island?" He's you still know, trying to figure did it you know out. Miami was an island. <laughs> and then what'd you say? I said, "No, it's not. It's in Florida." <laughs> what is what's Miami's the joke? not a an island? I was so confused. <laughs> well, I don't get the joke. Yeah, I don't get it. Coach is really cracking up about it <laughs> because that was like two weeks ago. <laughs> yeah, and you just now thought of it. I, again? I just can't get it out of my head. What, what, what were you trying right. to get at so with the Miami I was, as an island? I was trying to convince him that Miami was an island. Oh, just for fun? Yeah, just like off the coast of is Florida. Is this the same way that you convinced a bunch of your Instagram followers that you have a twin? Oh, yeah. That was funny. That's but you didn't hilarious. convince me. You just like just <laughs> acted dumb. I uh, <laughs> I was on Instagram and I posted a picture. like same pic- So it's like a picture of me when I was uh, 12 and a picture of me when I was 14. And like... Between they those did, two you years, you did look different enough yeah. to where it could be your twin. It looks really different between like the cheeks and like everything, but it also looked very cheeks. similar because I mean it's me. So I decided to post them side by side and be like, I just found my long lost twin, and this is a picture of him cooking, a picture of me eating something. Yeah, I remember. And yeah. It did look like a different person, but just it sort like, of did. But like the lighting was different. Yeah, no, that, yeah. that was brilliant. Convincing was, people who do like you. twelve people were like, oh my god, I didn't know you had a twin. I was like, me either until like right now. <laughs> I had a boss one time that told me it was his brother's birthday. And he had to go. Yeah. And I was like, oh, that's great. Tell your brother happy birthday. He goes, yeah, it's my twin brother. And I, and like for a second, I was like, wait, two things. One, but happy it's your birthday. birthday. <laughs> but also, yeah. are you fucking with me? Well, Do you have a twin? And so he wouldn't answer me. So for years, I didn't know he was true. He would always say it was his brother's birthday on his birthday. Finally, he showed me a picture of family with both of them in it. In a family, that's, he has a twin. Well, sometimes like, so the birth, the birth so can happen at like eleven fifty eight, and the kid's born at eleven fifty nine, and like the next, next kid's day. born at yeah. twelve. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh. So anyway, speaking of babies again, 
babies. On this labeling of the children, if you walked up to a baby, first of all, I don't walk up to babies and automatically think, oh, I got to touch this baby. I don't even want to touch what? the baby. How do you not? <laughs> <laughs> Look, who thinks, man, I got to touch this baby? Yeah, kid. right. That's what I'm saying. Like, who are these people? It's well, got to so be mostly pedophiles and women, right? What? Why, why women? women? What What man is walking oh God, to you? Walk into the mall baby. and you're like, can I hold your baby? No, I've never hey, asked yo, to hold a baby. To hold I don't want to hold the babies that were mine. I don't want to hold a stranger's baby. It, I definitely don't want to hold, if, there, if you have a baby with a sign on it, I'm not touching your baby because you've taken the time to print the sign. Some fucked up shit's going on and I'm going the other direction. <laughs> I'm not yeah. interacting with the baby with the sign on like they're it. one of those ones that puts a sign on their baby and says, stop. And just a stop I'm not sign. autistic. Yeah. I'm acoustic. Right. Like what, See, I would use it. I, there you go. I would use it for evil like that. I would put that on my acoustic baby. <laughs> While they're laughing. <laughs> no, but what if... What the fuck? What if humans are humans? What if babies are humans? What if adults had to wear signs? Like, what would your sign say? Like a pedophile had to wear a sign. Well, a I know Duracells or, would be yeah. professional retard. Now, you, I don't know. Mm. Why are you, no, what would your sign say? Me? You. Not my uh, sign. I guess. I agree with Duracells. Bagheera. Bagheera? Bagheera. Like the panther from Jungle Book? Yeah. God, we have the weirdest information trapped <laughs> in our conversation. Why are you calling him Bagheera? No, no, his I'm Bagheera. Oh, his you're Bagheera. Yeah, that makes no, a lot of sense. No, he's failed Luke uh, Skywalker. What? what? I'm, uh, I think I'm okay with that, but why? Uh, like <laughs> two years ago, you had really long hair. Yeah, that, you oh, looked like oh, was, Skywalker. I did have long hair. That was a mistake. <laughs> yeah. Just like. I love I that you what? guys didn't tell me it was a mistake. Nobody told me to cut it. I look back now and I'm like, what the ever loving fuck? I have hair past my shoulders and nobody said, <laughs> chop that. You guys all suck. That's what you're going to look like after quarantine. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If I don't get haircuts. We don't need haircuts. I can cut my own hair. I can cut y'all's hair. No, you can't. No. no. I've cut my nope. daughter's hair. Nope. You don't will care. shave my asshole and my taint before you touch my head. Sure, whatever. That's Why? Fine. That sounded really sexual. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your sign? That should be your sign that you're wearing in public. You, you will shave, shave my taint my and my and asshole before, before you touch, touch my head. Oh, yeah, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> What the? Sorry, fuck? I didn't know it was gonna be ear rape. <laughs> yeah, see, that is. What about you, Darius? What's your sign? Professional retard. That's really gonna be your sign. Yeah. Uh, professional you can't that retard. Why not? I don't know. You could. Get you know so much you could, attention. You, know you could put tall. Act like a retard. You could put tall. Little professionally. Tall little person. Tall little makes no sense. Vertically challenged midget. No, what's Just the opposite? The purpose. Vert, what's vertically enhanced midget? Because he's not a midget. He's a regular size human. What? <laughs> Duracell is a regularly tall sized person. He's a midget. No, no, no. Coach is a midget. No, and has diabetes. No, no. <laughs> Fix your life. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm playing. Sorry, I've watched too much Family Guy. <laughs> I don't even know what to do with you right now. I just was going to see how far that went. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to go all Goku on me, throw a spirit bomb at me, Speaking or something. Speaking of Family Guy, though, we are all like double repeats of things. Like that. someone needs to come out with something. I tried to watch. Uh, there's a new show, The Baker and the Beauty. Horrible, horrible. What's that? It's I like Beauty wanna... and the Beast, but garbage. It's, it's not at all. Well, like I've been catching up on The Walking Dead. So that's worthwhile. What's yes. Walking Dead? This is what we get with him. This together, you guys, you know, like know half of pop culture, and you know half of pop culture, and together you know everything. But separately, you're like half dumb. Both of you are half dumb. You're half dumb. No, I'm all dumb. I know what the Walking Dead is. Set dumb. I like Fear of the Walking Dead better though. Yeah, you met the uh, actress from that. Oh yeah, so I was. Uh, what was her, what's her name? I can't remember her name. Uh, Alicia. Yeah. On the show, yeah, she's named Alicia Keys. Keys. No, uh, we. Concrete it's funny because he met her twice tomato. in like a week span. Once on purpose, once bumped into her. What are the chances of that happening? Yeah, it was weird. It was while they were filming down here. Yeah, yeah. Were well, they still filming? Remember when we went to oh, New York and anymore. thought we saw Brie Larson? Well, yeah. I know they film all their water scenes here. They're gonna, because uh, I have a friend. Uh, I have a friend. I have a friend that no. works on the show, and they're gonna film here again. You've got a friend in me. Well, they they. Yeah, uh, didn't they film at the uh, baseball stadium? Yeah, 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 yeah. They filmed they, the whole, they the whole season. But they filmed their like water scenes at this place over there off of um one eight uh, interstate. Well, what's it called? I thirty five. One. <laughs> one what did you say? One eight interstate. Uh, I was trying to say one eight hundred. You are just belching. Dude, I'm, what did Karen feed you? She made this um ham and bean like it was like seventeen bean soup. Oh, that's delicious. Is there delicious. any left? Um, oh, I think so. No, it's uh, not worth it. I'll bring some over if there is. Don't do it. Pop a couple brewskis. Yeah, hey, sit in the backyard and social distance. Talk about these black folks. <laughs> no, <I'm boy. laughs> what is that from? I think that sounds um, so oh, familiar. Oh, it's the Cleveland show or something? It sounds like Cleveland. 
What? Oh, the, sound, wait, sound, what? Have you watched Paradise PD before on Netflix? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It sounds like that one, uh, Fat Cop. Let's no. talk about these black folks. I don't no. know. Well, he's more like a high pitch. He's like, eh, fuck them. Like, fuck. Like, he's really high pitch. Oh my God. You should do like vocal work. You have. A, what, why is that? You have a big range. I, I really don't understand what you mean. Yeah. You have all kinds of. Do Morgan Freeman. Uh, uh, as the white boy <laughs> walks across the street, he tries to touch my genitalia. <laughs> 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 Half the fun is watching your face, your lips. You have they, to, you have to like go into character. Yeah, your lips make different shapes when you do different voices. Exactly. That's right. <laughs> so it's so good. <laughs> All right, check this. I'm going to show it to you. Ready, Darius? you get first dibs. I mean, what? When I'm, Please don't be a dick. <laughs> <laughs> I really wanted you to show him a dick. I was like, he's going to see a penis. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise! Surprise! <laughs> Is that a COVID gaming chair? Wow, yeah. thank, thank yeah. you for spoiling it for me. It's not, it's, not, it's not right. It's not what it is. Japan has created right. the ultimate Coach is going to read it. <laughs> well, I didn't want to read it. I, to be clear, let me just explain Can what I just happened. finish? Yes. Japan has created the ultimate gaming bed, so never have to rejoin society again. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so I showed Duracell a picture of the article that reads, Japan has created the ultimate gaming bed with a picture I of the bed. I just said that. And well, you told him. Goes, you showed me what is me that? not to say anything. <laughs> Don't say anything. All I said was but, I looked like a COVID. You're like, game what is chair. it? A COVID. Like the, this is funny. I show it to Coach. Personality wise, it's different, right? You were like imaginative to go. What is that? Coach is like, oh, Japan has created the Are ultimate gaming bed to go into depth and just explain everything. We're on a talk show, but like that's like Patrick Star level type of shit. I'm the, a professional the starfish from. The Sponge show Bob? under the water? Yes. Yeah, uh, the show under the water? Okay. Uncultured swine. Uh, who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Not Mr. you. Mr. Krabs? What no. the fuck? He doesn't live under the sea. I'm with you. I'm <laughs> with Listen you. to me. I'm speaking. I'm Japan speaking. has created the ultimate gaming bed. So you uh, never well, We already read that, didn't we? Yes, we've read it four times okay, now. Okay, so this bed... <laughs> What does the bed do, Adam? <laughs> Wait, I, I didn't hear you. Can, you. can you read it to me again? One more time. Japan slowly. Slowly. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Deepest voice you can go is slowly. Oh, yeah. Japan has created the ultimate gaming bed, so you never have to rejoin society again. You made me very uncomfortable. <laughs> it's like really bad ASMR. Oh, hey, can you? That would really be like a horrible thing if somebody was like, "I'm gonna be a big breakout star," and ASMR. They're like, "No, you, you suck at being quiet." No, because like they're like, so you know how like, people are down here. He's just constantly talking at a normal level and yeah, just like, like here, let me blow into the mic. <laughs> like, so this company in Japan, they make gaming furniture. Okay, like gaming chairs that makes kid have a better aim. Yes. Yes. I actually saw Very a thing bitter. where you put some kind of red sight on the actual television, and the controller picks up the infrared. S- marker and always aims your gun in the middle and supposedly you're not ever supposed to miss anymore why is it in the middle i don't know i don't not yeah, in the middle? yeah i don't understand it. it like somehow i don't understand it at all but i've seen this thing about it anyway here's the bed right it's got it looks like it's a dorm room size bed i guess it was it looks a like tween, a mini fridge a tween a tween a twin they uh, made it for covid i i guess i mean it could be they're pretty quickly about it comes with a very large um what do you call that? Bean bag right in the middle, so you can like lean back on the bean bag, sit on the bean bag. It's surrounded with carts that roll away. I'll put some pictures on the podcast. So you're telling me I can just stay in there forever? Yeah, check it out. So on this one, you, there's the bed, right? One did is two big televisions, your gaming consoles. It's everything. a monitor. Those are two monitors. What did I say? Televisions. televisions. Oh, the fuck! Forgive me, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, for real. There's two Fucking displays bear, at the end of the tele- of the bed. Mm, that's not right. Anyway, there's a gaming console, just a place to hold two cups, and then check it out. You can pull out the bed and just scoot up all the way and make that a desk. So like, mm. if I, it basically said I can never leave again, like I never have to go back inside. Yeah, there's a, well, is there a mini fridge? fridge? There, yeah, a, yeah, that's my a, same question. There's a fridge there in this thing fridge? that looks like there's a place to hold snacks and like Cokes and chips. I can store my So, so I still bolt. have to go back into society if I want to restock. I mean, restock. I mean somebody, do you have a microwave? Look, no, I don't think it's a microwave, but look, oh, when no. you're laying down, it has a place to hold your phone above your head so you don't even touch it. That's the only thing I want. The phone for the head thing? Yep. All right. I'm down with that. You know uh, what I want? What? Cheesecake. Ah, oh, cheesecake. Uh, anyway, how much do you think this thing costs? Diabetic. Doesn't include Six, the gaming console. 600 bucks. Oh, wait, it doesn't come with like the no, monitors? Oh, it doesn't come. Yeah, 600. Oh, yeah, the monitors, but not the console. Oh, 600, oh. 600 bucks. Okay. 
Okay. That is actually mm. the price. <laughs> oh, really? I was yeah. going to say seven fifty. You haven't gone three minutes without farting or burping. I'm so sorry. <laughs> These beans that Karen made, they're magical. Hey, it's not worth it. Was it. All, it was like 17 beans. That's why you're probably diabetic, burnt by everything. the way. Dude, they were good. <laughs> so is it worth it? Is uh, it diabetic worth it? Yeah. You can't eat half the shit you eat because you're a diabetic, I mean, I but you still could, do it. I don't know if you can say no. he can't eat it because he ate it. Yeah, so, I mean, exactly. It's eating. I, ju- I just said that. Stuff, no, I mean, I don't know if you can't say that. I, I, yeah, I, well, I you think, can't. I think I've taken short. I think midget. I think <laughs> Why call him a midget? <laughs> because. And didn't we decide that we tall. can't say midget? Oh, yeah. Middle? Sorry. Sorry. Vertically challenged retard. No, that's not no, what it is. is. <laughs> that's not any you better. You dwarf. Dwarf. Oh, yeah. What was it? What did we figure it out? The dwarf, dwarf or little person is what they. Oh, well, you got to go back and watch the Fred Piles cast and correct me. Okay. I'll go back. You're a dwarf I'll send my future with diabetes. Self back. I am a six foot two tall man. Understand? I don't know if any of that's Jan? true. No. Because I got the plan you're man. Not six two. He might be. You ain't no fan you're man. Two six. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, people are trying to buy this bed, right? Yeah. In the comments, they're like, "Hey, yeah. where's the link to the bed?" And people like scroll up, and the next guy goes, "I don't see it." And the next guy goes back, goes, "He said scroll up. It's right there." And it goes on for like twenty seven comments. Just scroll up. It's right above you, and no one's telling the guy like where the link's at. Now I scroll it up. Where is it? I can't find the link. <laughs> I don't know where it's at either. Uh, I'm still scrolling up. I'm still scrolling up. I got nothing. Oh, there's a one little link that says catalog. So click on their catalog. What do we get here? The website is called translate.googleus. Oh, uh, <laughs> Coach. It costs like 100,000. It costs 100,000 yen. Do you have is beats? That, is that 600 bucks? That doesn't seem like that. Wait, say it one more time. 100,000 yen is 600 bucks? Well, if we oh, there goes my phone. There goes your phone. Like what is the people are just what is the currency rich. from yen to dollars? What's the yen worth? I guess. How do you spell yen again? Y e n. Oh, that is Y I N. Uh, it might. Be, I don't think it is. I think I'm right. No, I think he's right too. Right, it here we is. Go. Um, they sell a lot of gaming furniture, man. So it was a thousand yen. 100,000. 100,000. Uh, that's a lot of zeros. <laughs> I think it's seven. It's uh, just a lot of money, I feel like. Wait, is it seven or six zeros? I it is $933.98. So it must be, it must be a sale if it's only 600 bucks then. Yeah. Anyway. It's on sale. Yeah! It's on sale. You mean sale. this? Yeah. Well, yeah. All right, here's the bed. I found the bed on their actual website, and it says, oh, you can customize it. So you don't have to like buy the otherwise. No, you don't have to actually buy the bed. So you can buy, there's a bed, uh, an Jericho. elevating headboard, a gaming blanket. What's the gaming it blanket? It says no use 4G. I don't know what that means. It's 11,000 yen though. You don't know what blanket. 4G is? Well, what is no use 4G? On a blanket. Is the blanket streaming Four cell phone? Grand. No, no, no. I don't think it's what it means. <laughs> 4G bars from blankets. Gaming sofa, <laughs> headphone hanger, energy Here wagon, slim bottle rack, long side bed table. So, I, oh, in reference... Reference total. I don't know why they call it a reference total. So it's 126 dollars So it's more expensive than we thought. What a guy. Yeah, they should really add a... Uh, uh, all right, Tam. What's his name? Tally. Refrigerator. Tally. Who's Tally? From, South, From Park. South Park. What a guy. Oh, it's Tally. Yeah. Not Tally. Towel. Well, I would right. like a gaming chair, but I'd also want to get up. Your I wouldn't want to stay in there forever. Yeah, it doesn't look... I, I just get, want the chair part. I don't want the yeah, bed. Yeah, the bed part looks a little bit much, but... Okay. You ready for this? Yes. Yes. I've been of course. Waiting. I've been, been waiting, waiting for this my entire life. <laughs> how, how? How? How would you explain <laughs> 2020 to in some, one sentence to someone in, in 2010? In, how would you explain? And do we have like a, a limit? <sighs> no, I have. I have the answer, but I want to hear yours. So, how would you explain right, 2020 I'll go last, then. to someone in 2010? Ready? Right, I'm going to say it in a couple of words. Right? Okay. I yeah. finished. Pornhub. Uh, oh, well. <laughs> okay. I I, mine you? also was Pornhub. <laughs> uh, you guys. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, I got another one. No, I, I'm trying to think of another one now. I actually um, predicted by the end of this, people will be bored of porn. The Office is way better watching it nine times. Okay. Actually, I've watched it 14 times. Okay, fair enough. And um, just in a few sentences... I don't care how many sentences. I gave you no limit. Oh, you gave me no limit? I think Duracell over here put well, some limit on it. Music's gone to shit. What did? Music. Music? Yeah. Why did music go to shit? It's been pretty shitty. Okay. Eh. 
I mean, there's a few songs, like literally a few. Nice. Others are just either repeats of old songs or old songs with new beats on it. I, yeah, I don't have. You're right. I haven't liked a lot of pop music that's come out lately. Yeah, and then um, it's a really good point. I hadn't even thought about that. Way yeah. to bring down 2020 for me. Food has been just blooming. There's been more like inventions of food than there was in 2010. You know what I saw? That's Porn. probably that's no, probably okay. true. No, like I like people are getting creative. Um, I saw people put two waffles and then put the eggs around the waffles, like crack the eggs, yeah. then flip it and then fold it a certain way where the waffle oh, yeah. is like holds the yeah, egg. Yeah, like I want to try that. But they put ham and cheese in there. Yeah. I yeah. saw someone get like a bunch of egg yolk and then flip a French, uh, a piece of bread in it and then cook it seven times trying to make French toast. And they couldn't do it or they did do it? Oh, they did. Oh. Like, a also, lot, like 17 times. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> okay. You ready for the actual, the actual answer? Yeah. <laughs> Imagine if 10 years ago you were approached by a time traveler and he was like, look, I don't have much time to explain. Wait, hold up, hold up. So you're saying time traveling is possible in 2020? Well, if that's the case, then I'd go back to 1970. No, no we're in 2010. I need you to just listen. Okay. Going too far. Yeah. Because if you interrupt me, I have to start over and it's way too much to start over. I oh, start over. All right. So imagine if 10 years ago. One were, more time. <laughs> Sorry. So we can time travel. You were approached... <laughs> By a time traveler. Wait, 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 can you back up a little bit? <laughs> okay, I'm done. We're done. We're done. We're done. You're approached have, by a time traveler. I don't have the meme board, but if I did, I would be pushing some memes on you. I don't know what it would be. No. What is that? I don't know. Click it. Oh, story. story time? All right. Imagine if 10 years ago you were approached by a time traveler. He was like, look, I don't have much time to explain. All I can tell you is that the year 2020 is going to be an absolute shit show. You know Donald Trump? star of the apprentice well he's the president of the united states at the beginning of 2020 he gets into a twitter beef with iran that almost starts world war three australia catches fire and a woman tries to save it by spelling selling pictures of her tits and kobe, that's a fact kobe bryant passes away in a helicopter crash half the world is devastated the other half just makes fucked up memes a little time passes <laughs> and just today. When, a little time passes and just when you start recovering from the loss of kobe some dude in china eats a fucking raw ass bat and starts a global pandemic that's that why they can't play baseball that specifically kills everyone's that's grandparents terrible. everyone loses their minds 40 percent of the populations think it's the end of the world another 40 percent think it's all fake and 20 percent blame the whole thing on cell phone towers and tom hanks fucking kids the Wait, one thing well, yeah, i never heard that part yeah. tom hanks fucks kids no it's not <laughs> the thing wow. the one thing that everyone seems to agree on is that the only way to survive is by hoarding toilet paper Grocery stores are ransacked, and Charmin Ultra Soft essentially replaces the dollar as the United States official currency. My honey clean. Eventually, oh, as so hysteria baby grows, boom. yeah. Eventually, as hysteria, hysteria grows, world governments are fo- forced to shut the entire planet down, lock everyone in their houses, and only one person <coughs> that can keep the people, and only one person that can keep the people from completely flipping out and starting a huge fucking riot is a gun-toting to- homosexual Oklahoma man with a meth addiction and 180 pet tigers. Oh, I'm yeah, Tiger, Tiger King. King. Fuck that bitch, Carol Baskin. She killed her Fuck husband. <laughs> That's it. That's I am Carol Baskin. I, mean, I weigh 315 you, pounds, you forgot to and I fed my what husband to a COVID. tiger. Oh, that's the whole China bat thing. I know. I'm fucking with you. Fucking with me. I thought he fucked the bat. No, no they ate it. How do you even fuck a bat? At that I, point, the dick You know what? You got me there. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I read this, and at first I thought it was pretty funny, because it is pretty funny. So what? you're on there. What did he just say? <laughs> so the Chinese have small dicks, so like it wouldn't be impossible. You know, just because the guy in the hangover jumped out of the back of the locked trunk and seemed to show us that that was true, we shouldn't assume that. No, it's uh-huh. been proven. Okay. Who proved it? Google. Oh my god. If you actually look it up, black males are um in supposedly Jamaica. in Jamaica, yeah. Jamaican black males supposedly have the biggest dicks. We, we should ask that. I feel, we, I feel really like we've got, looked this up before. Has really got to us. <laughs> Did you say pornatine? Quarantine. Oh, said pornatine. I know you want to go watch porn after this, but you just no, need to wait. I've finished it. I'm done with porn. I'm moving on to something else now. Yeah. New videos obsessed. every day. No. Yeah. They're all recycled. Uh, <laughs> like the music. <laughs> no, I read this the first time and I thought, this is pretty funny. Then I read it the second time and I'm like, oh my God, it's true. There's nothing here that's made up. It's all true shit. And then uh, it is. No, well, the bat, I don't the know bat's the pretty Tom questionable. Hanks. I'm pretty sure you fucked the bat. Oh, I don't know if the Tom Hanks kids thing either. Yeah, I didn't. Well, I didn't know Tom Hanks fucked kids. He has COVID. Yeah, I know that. I, I, thought, I thought that was a scam. That he got paid to say that. No, I never, no, that's not true. <laughs> what <are> you, <laughs> not using my mouth. Okay, let's get my brother Long Hello, 
Longfellow Hawk, Hawk, on the, Hawk the Cock. Yeah. Hawk. Now yeah. this motherfucker. <laughs> First time in the cock. First time in it. Yeah. Why are you in a cock? What are you, Ant Man? All right. <laughs> He's never been on the podcast, so we have to be nice to him. Hello, this is Longfellow Hawk Trout. Longfellow Hawk Trout. It's Adam Eagle Trout. How the fuck are you? I'm doing well. Thanks Hawk the cock. Me. I've got Coach and Duracell here now. You know the boys, right? Uh, of course. Well, I want to thank you for taking some time out of your very difficult and important and essential schedule to talk to us today about our question of the week. Question. Question? Question. Question? Question. Of the week. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we usually have question of the week music, but since we called you, we'll have to just hum it. Dun, 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 yeah, dun, thanks a lot. Mm, 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 I don't know Wait, the way. I really that, don't know the song. Sense. No, all you just hummed right then was the, mm, the, mm, the theme mm, to <laughs> Beverly Hills Cop. I think. I think I did too. All right, ba, 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 ba. Longfellow. They From, don't. They don't believe that our parents were hippies. Can you back me up on that? Yeah, uh, this is this is the Longfellow Hawk. Hey, uh, <laughs> they taught me to whistle in Native American. Who did? Can our you, parents? Our, our, our hippie parents. <laughs> All right, let's see it. Yeah, it, can you give us a little here? Are you ready? Not quite. Well, hold on. Let me. Oh, a you're, bit, you're yeah. saying you're saying come over here. The beans are ready. Uh, close enough. Yeah. Close enough. Yeah. There's a tribe uh, approaching <laughs> to kill. But I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you got. Whatever you yeah, got. It, it, it wants the same. Uh, same reaction. Hey, speaking of killing, it's topical because the question of the week is one that Duracell came up with. Yes. Uh, if the purge happened, who would be the first person you would purge? <laughs> no! <laughs> no! 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 All right, we found a chip wrapper from last week. Yeah. And I think it's the chip wrapper that made me throw up. Me and it. I touched all inside of it. Let me see it. <laughs> Let me see. I'm going to smell it. No, nope, the smell's gone. You're totally you're safe. There's no smell. Smell your fingers. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. All right, Longfellow. If the purge happened, yeah, yeah. if the purge happened, who would be the first person you would purge? But for, can I say Hitler? Well, he's already he's been already purged. But you could purge him again if you're into what a hero. He killed himself. Yeah, There's a statue. He purged himself. Yeah, he purged himself. There is there is no statue though. We talked about that. He needs a statue. Yeah. What? Durcell thinks Hitler needs a statue. I agree. He needs a statue. All right. Who would you purge? Wait, we're not gonna. We're gonna, just, uh, we're gonna glance over the uh, Hitler statue thing. No, we're just not even gonna go back. <laughs> that uh, I mean, we don't even. Yeah, I can't. So there, we don't. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> right. Is all you got Hitler? That's the end of your list. <laughs> Hitler. Well, I, I mean, would. Like, I was. I was just so ready to do it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so like you're about to have sex with him, not kill him. Well. With Longfellow, you don't know how it's going to go down. All right, what the cock? Well, who, who says what order what's going to happen? <laughs> no, I what? Mean, what? Oh, oh my yeah. God. I don't know. Wait, when I, well, when I purge, sir, <laughs> I'm He doesn't mess around. In. Well, he knows the yeah. saying then. Necrophilia? Yeah. going to rape that body. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think there's a better saying than that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Duracell, who would you purge? You're purging somebody for Back in eighth grade, my fucking English teacher. You're going to purge a teacher? Wow. I'm yeah. so surprised you didn't say my wife. No, we need to no, keep her for comedy. No, the English really. teacher was way worse. You're going to kill a teacher. She was a sexist piece of shit. Oh. All right. She's dead to all yeah. of us then. All right. Coach. Hey, yep. I... Oh, sorry, Longfellow. No, no well, Longfellow, well, you is, go right ahead. <laughs> uh, thank you. There is something that I just, I just thought of uh, in a reversal of questions. For the for the uh, in tradition of when you get called by a podcast of reversing the question they ask <laughs> you to put it back on them with a different question. Okay, are you ready? Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, yeah. What is your favorite <laughs> children's porno? <laughs> what? What? Oh yeah, I got a whole list. Your, Wait, is yeah, the, your, what is the your question? favorite children's porno nursery rhyme? Oh. Go, go, I don't have Baba a... Baba Black Sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Three bags full. It sounds so... <laughs> How is that That's so hook? dirty. The porno He's fight. got three bags that. full. I don't, I don't know any children's porno nursery rhymes, I don't think. Do you, do you know one? Well, I just know, like, uh, Old Mother Hubbard went to the cupboard to fetch your poor dog a bone. 
But when she bent over, Rover took over and gave her a bone of his own. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yo. Uh, uh, I, want, I want all of my nursery rhymes to be pornographic. But we've realized that if we go to, to, to the nursery rhyme store and ask for children porno, that's all they're going to hear. Children porno nursery rhymes. They're not going to – they don't want to hear – how the many, rest of it. Yeah, how many times have you uh, had to run that? out of the store rapidly because of that? It's every time. Uh, <laughs> they, don't even, <laughs> they don't want you to say it. When okay. you go into any place and you say, I'm here for the children porn, they don't let you even finish <laughs> They don't even the let you. Sentence. They're like, sir, please leave. All right. Let, now here's, let us I, take you to the I thought of something awesome. It's old Mother Hubbard went to the cupboard to fetch her uh-huh. old dog a bone. Morgan Freeman the shit out of that. I, I don't even remember what he old, said. Old Mother Hubbard. Old Mother. Uh, <clears throat> old Mother Hubbard. Went to the cupboard. Went to the cupboard. To fetch her old dog a bone. To fetch her old dog a bone. But when she bent over. But when she bent over. Rover took over. Rover took over. And gave her a bone of his own. And gave her a bone of his own. That <laughs> <laughs> oh, amazing. Yeah, that was the highlight oh, of my day, God. really. Funny. I would have finished the Tiger King's job and kill that bitch, Carol Baskin. Oh, that's a good one. Mm-hmm. That's a good one. Yeah. Or Justin Bieber. Uh, I, I don't think... What? Well, he oh, hates yeah. Duracell. Or, he, did or Taylor hours. Swift. he did 10,000 no. hours. Duracell really hates Taylor Swift. She, he don't like no Tay-Tay, and he nope. don't like the JB. He also doesn't Eat like him. when that uh, when the bass, all about that bass. Oh, yeah, yeah. Megan that? Trainor. Megan Tra- he hates Megan Trainor. Yeah. No. But she's all about that bass. <laughs> about that bass. No, no treble. No, stop. <laughs> I will leave. His name is No. His I don't sign know. is No. His number is No. You need to let what it go. About, We're six feet apart, but about, my legs can reach that. How do you feel about dabbing on haters, though? <laughs> dabbing on dabbing haters? haters? I, dab on I feel like I want to take a selfie. But first... Because that makes me want to choke a kitten. <laughs> well, next time I see you, I'm dabbing on you. <laughs> he's gonna better bring a, a kitten. He's going <laughs> to bring a kitten. <laughs> he's going to choke a kitten. I don't. I can't think. You know, I thought about this question because I've known it for a bit. I can't think of anybody I want to purge necessarily. I know I can't either. I mean, at this point, I've been purging all, all along up to this point anyway. Yeah, like I wait. Like if you if you hear the sound of my voice, but my name is not in. If your name's not in my phone, like I can't call you. You've been purged. I mean, <laughs> That's yeah. how it works. Yeah. yeah, I'm not. I'm not looking. So you tell me you wouldn't kill anybody if the purge happened. I mean, not. I can't. LHT uh, don't go like that. That's not how LHT rolls. You know. Yeah. Yeah, uh-huh. long uh, you know, we, yeah. It took it took us a minute to figure accident. out what the hell you were talking about. <laughs> <laughs> we're all like LHT. Now that he does go by LHT, oh, he's making his own like society, yeah. well, like, LGBTQ a- group, or whatever. Yeah, Q seven, LBJQ LHT. It's no, I just figured out what LGB- they all stands for. Oh, bisexual. Hold on, there we wait go. a minute. You just figured out what what stood for? The whole thing. LGBTQ. I didn't know it stood for like each type of. Th- okay, hold on. Do you know what it stands for? Yeah. Do it in Morgan Freeman's voice. <laughs> What? Lesbian, <coughs> lesbian, gay, bisexual, in question, transgender, <laughs> and there's one more act. Oh, queer. <laughs> okay, and you know what it means? Well, he just said it. Yeah, but did you know it before do it. that? Do it. He, now, do it. I'm, I just figured I'm out like putting, last night. I'm bumpering between the two of you so I can forget. You can forget what it meant. Now go. Tell me what it means. Lesbian. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that would work. What? What? In question. It means like you don't understand if you like. So first, you're confused about your gender and who you like sexually. That's a sexual orientation. I don't think is it confused. You just don't know. You've all right. So you like something. Some things make you feel like you're a boy. Like oh yeah, I would definitely want to go hang out with the boys. But then like some things like but I want to get a manicure with them or something like that. You know? I feel like if you're confused, <laughs> think you're just gay. <laughs> no no, no. <laughs> like in that way. <laughs> I feel like if you're questioning, thank you right? like it in the like, butt. I get confused but, when I fall and hit my head. But when I about my sexuality, the only if you're going to question something, look, you imagine like, if someone got a think like, of a it this way and they turned like gay. I think that has happened before. What? Just I feel bad for that. Think person. of it this Longfellow way. Longfellow was was gay for like a season. What? What do you mean? Well, I, season, like, I, winter? I, I was canoeing <laughs> and. A eagle. Uh, it was Adam <laughs> Son. <laughs> Adam Son was a friend of mine. We used to go canoeing together, and Adam Son hit me in the head with an oar. And then I, we did anal stuff. <laughs> what the fuck? With the oars. I just oh, no. This I, is why I can't call you. I, this is why I can't have you in the podcast. You've 
you've got in the head. somehow we've got a sex thing in a canoe. Wait, the coach threatened the president a minute ago. The show's gone off the rails. <laughs> no. Right, got <laughs> promise. Got he off the rails. Introduces got raped by your best friend. With no, you better hide. Oh. oh my god. Okay, well on that note, uh, Longfellow, thank you for the phone call. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the great stuff. All right. Well, we'll see you again, again later. Stay uh, safe. We'll long fellow hawk trout out. Bye. It's a button. I feel like if you're born with a penis or a vagina, We're you have the that? right to change. Okay. But, I, but you're still born with a penis or a vagina. Okay. So you're male or female. Oh, also, like, fuck that about, I'm for 72 you, gender but shit. But if you change, then you change. You should just be what you change to, no? Yeah, you can't. I'm not saying that you can do that. I'm just saying you shouldn't be in questioning. There's, there's yeah, right the, now, yeah, the part that is questions weird, too. I feel like you know what you were born with. Yeah. And then you, yeah. if you're confused, then you probably are bi for a little bit until you make up your mind. And then you're yeah. like, the questioning thing, I don't get why that's a thing either. Me neither. And the whole 72 genders, whatever. Is, is there really 70? Dumb. Why do you there, both? There's girls... That are like, oh, there's 72 genders, huh? I can only name they, like they two They dye genders. their hair blue, and it's really bad. There are huh. two, three, four, even five genders. Well, well, if there's 70 genders, then why do two of them only have the coronavirus? Well, think of it what? this way. <laughs> if there's 72 genders, that means men are better than 71 genders! Woo! There's actually only one gender. I've never heard Male. of gender, this 72 gender thing ever. Really? No. I have to it's research. All over the internet. All right, well, thanks again yep. for listening to this. The, what are we called? The, the I just, almost just said the podcast. Oh. <laughs> listening to the podcast. The comment section bullshit. The CSBS. Yeah, we do this uh, one weekly. Don't get a concussion. You might get you might be into gay. an anal session. Enter an okay. anal session. I'm going to stop recording now. <laughs> Sodomy.